Welcome back today guys to the channel back here for some huge news on Apex Point. Now it seems like we've been getting some regular updates on this game and they have just been dropping update after update in turn making this game better one step at a time. Today is no different and we have some brand new features getting added into the game. We have some brand new cars and I'm pretty excited to talk about it for today. So we have another Apex Point key to give away courtesy of uh, Apex Point Studios, right? So huge thank you to them. All you guys need to do, comment down below Apex Point. I'll be randomly picking a winner in 24 hours time. Huge thanks for coming around for today. And of course, before we start, dad joke of the day here, coming from dad jokes on Twitter. What is the medical diagnosis for owning too many dogs? A Roverdose. <laughs> I like that, man. Huge thanks for watching today. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. Game on Steam, 800 and 94 very positive reviews that's fantastic to see obviously these guys have been putting in a lot of work played 16.8 hours of the game user reviews very positive three friends play this game and it's 2179 if you guys were wondering it's currently in early access so we are an indie game studio that consists of a small group of devs we have been spending our personal money on apex point for years but recently the project got bigger so releasing the game as an early access will help with receiving feedback on the game to improve it and will speed up the development process which i actually did not know how long will the game be in early access the game might remain in early access for a couple of years because it depends on the development team and feedback we receive about the game so it's definitely going to be interesting to see what they do but it's great the game is out it's early access version right it says full version is planned to have the fall Following, working multiplayer huge car list multiple races in each type racing drag drift street wangon races etc an extended map including the expressway wangon linked with mountain passes toge and racetracks man we got a lot coming here for apex point but today though the big news is the work in progress update this was dropped on sunday may 21st 2023 and hopefully everybody had a good may 24 weekend right if you're canadian turn this off with the guy just staring us down work in progress preview of the next update so the last couple of weeks apex point received a huge amount of work which helped us get one step closer to what we had imagined for the release Here's a list of only some of the major changes and additions to Apex Point coming in the next update. Added a drag race career against 20 racers, an active bet system. That is pretty cool to see that. I, I thought we were just getting a drag racing setup on here. No, we're getting also active betting and 20 racers. How that we're gonna have a 20 player drag racing tournament? That's crazy, right? I can't wait, man. And we get to bet. So that's a big thing too. I love the fact that we're going to be able to bet. The 8.6 and the Honda look great there. Oh my goodness, man. They make their builds look so good on these photos. Can we zoom into it? Oh yeah, we can. Look at that. That's so cool. I like how they did this here. The full drag strip. We're going to probably have his arms go up and they're going to drop. Now I'm hoping that we can jump the gun, right? I'm hoping that we can jump his arms and, you know, be disqualified if we get too nervous in terms of going. It looks like that 8.6 just did a fat reverse burnout before the line. Holy so, We'll have to wait and see what they do. We have another one here. Look at this guy, man. That's so funny. No plate. Illegal, right? The car's not even on the road. How is he drag racing? Built this car earlier. We haven't built the 8.6 like this, though. I think we've done a little bit with the 8.6, but we haven't actually built it. I'm looking to do some more builds very soon. Two added vehicles are coming in. First up is the YN85, and we have, I'm assuming what looks like a Nissan pickup truck. It could be a Volkswagen pickup, which I actually did see a Volkswagen pickup the other day. I don't know the names of them offhand, but uh, yeah, super cool, super rare. This looks good though. I'm actually super excited to have a pickup coming into Apex Point. Um, I don't, I'm pretty sure this is our same garage. It doesn't look anything different. That's gonna be a fun truck to build. Super excited. So that's the first one. That's the YN85. And we have a second vehicle getting added in. We got another shot of this. Hopefully there's a bunch of different add-ons for the beds. You know, the tailgate, I'm assuming. We got some round drum brakes back there. Three, it says, th oh, there's not two vehicles. That's just number two in the list. I thought there was two vehicles, man. I got excited. One, right? Two, not two added vehicles, just Two added a new vehicle. Oh my, right? I gotta read better, man. My goodness, here. Three major visual improvements, post processing effects, ambient occlusion, environment lighting, and colors, higher fidelity shadows. 
which I'm assuming they're showing off here with the Honda Civic, which do look nice because that was one of the biggest things that I had. I had a kind of a big problem when it was sunlight outside. It was just, it was very bright. You really didn't even want to be in the direct sunlight. Um, it didn't really look as realistic as I wanted it to be. So I'm excited to see that they have been tweaking this and uh, we're going to get something new. We should be getting this update within the next coming days. Then we have another picture here uh, showing the Honda Civic completely jacked up. Holy gee. Around. I'm hoping that they also did something with the garage. Uh, that was one of my big things too, is when you're driving from the street to the garage, it's just, it's very just open. It's, it's very just low detail. There's no road or pathway. It's just concrete. So I'd like to see them maybe do something to make it look a little bit more like a parking lot almost, right? And then we had four added gear ratio adjustments. Some extra tuning available. I like that. So we have new tuning, new car, we have new visual improvements, and then we have drag racing. That's gonna be a big update. I don't know when exactly this is coming down. Preview of next update. So this was dropped on the 21st. So let's see the previous update was the big gas station one, right? We knew that one. So if we go back here to their Steam sneak peeks, this was our first one that we did, April 16th, and then the update followed on April 28th. Oh, damn. That's actually some time away. Okay, so if we follow the same logic for this, right, the sneak peek May 21st, probably what, mid-June, I'm assuming we're gonna get this update? Mid-June-ish, right? All right, so it's definitely rolling, right? That's the cool thing, the ball is rolling with Apex Point and they are putting time and dedication into this I game. I really like the fact that they're showing us the work in progress before it actually comes out, giving them time to get maybe a little bit extra more feedback from it and then drop it down. I'm assuming, has anyone actually commented on this? Holy jeez, 20 comments already on here. Helix time, is that a Helix? Damn, I didn't know that. Thanks for adding the Helix, it's a Helix. Damn, I'm dumb, okay. So it'll be fun to see what it actually does virtually. Please add race AIs and map improvements. Yeah, that'd be huge. If we can have other people on the roads driving around, that's why I'm excited to see the drag racing update to actually have people on the road at the same time racing. And again, I don't understand the 20 car system though, right? 20 racers and active betting system. Let me know your best interpretation of that. What are we gonna see? We only see two cars here. Assuming it's like a playoff bracket tree, but 20 racers though, that's a lot, man. Right, and yesterday's episode, if you guys were around in the first hour, uh, greatest title ever made. That's all I'm saying, greatest title ever made, right? It, I couldn't believe it. No title, right? Just my damn slap trade on there. I couldn't write, the comments were great. Huge thank you for everybody that did come around in that first hour. Really did appreciate the push uh, to have that video actually continue to do well in that day, even with the title screw up. We did right? have Apex Point drop this down two days ago, May 21st. Some stuff happened lately. New features coming soon. We added AI drag racing with an active bed system, new car coming, which should be pretty useful for deliveries, which I didn't actually even think about. And then this was the big thing. They actually added in a video for us. Clip that they dropped for us here, 20 seconds long. However, there's no audio on it, but we do get a quick taste of what the cutscene is gonna look like at the very start of this drag race. Um, they may be at the airport, looks like, but it is a huge open area. His arms came up, no way. And he jumped. Holy. That's actually pretty cool right there. Reminds me of the old pinks all out racing on uh, speed TV. Oh my goodness, good old days of cable television. Huge right thanks for coming around for today. Apex Point with a upcoming update in what? Two weeks or so down below your thoughts, opinions, and what you'd like to see next done on this game. Make sure you guys do subscribe, post notifications, posting every single day, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So put all your thoughts down below. Huge thanks for coming around for today. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.